everyone, this is Reed. You're watching MOI. Today, we need to have a man chat. So don't go clicking off, running away, just because you're afraid of some conflict. Well, not that kind of conflict. But this is an important thing for men. And for women that are watching this, for you to pester your men on. And most people, if they're like me, and sort of the traditional oddball man, we get kind of comfortable, really enjoy things a certain way. It's like I've got underwear that is older than the freshman students graduating right now and going into college. Yeah, it's just because I like that underwear and so what I've had to patch it a couple times. I've got like four pairs of shoes and all of them are probably, you know, about seven or eight years old at this point, except for boots. I like Timberland Pro boots and I go through them about every two or three years, need to resole them and stuff. Well, the point I'm making here with this is we tend to really let things wear out. And I mean, I'd rather poke my own eyes out than go clothes shopping a lot of the times. And it's like, what was the last brand I, I liked that fit me well, worked well enough? Yeah, let's just get that. You know, just send Lee off to the store, have her get those. And I'm like, ah, don't involve me, just pick that up. It's just kind of the way we are. But in terms of preparedness, we need to have more useful things that have some more life in them. I mean, if all things go to crap and, you know, resources become scarce and, you know, my shoes are all worn out and everything else, I got a big problem on my hands. It's not like I'm going to be gardening barefoot. Well, I may be forced to be, but that's going to be misery. And then, of course, the infections, possible parasites, everything else it leads to, not helpful. So for all of us men out there, go buy some more clothes, get a bunch more socks. I mean, I just recently retired a bunch of socks, going to turn them all into a quilt. They had holes the size of my fist. But the other parts were still good. They really were, I swear. So get new socks, get more shoes, get more shirts, get more pants. Now I'm working on losing some weight. I've had fairly good success so far. If you look at some of my older videos, and I've got one I'm editing right now, I was a lot heavier. But I'm not too worried. See, I figure, you know, in times of great calamity or like we're short on food and all that, we're all going to be losing weight. Uh, sewing, we can, you know, shrink things up. So not to worry about that. Take the seams out of your pants, hem things up, shrink the waistline. We can do that. On belts, I do recommend an infinitely adjustable belt just for that reason. I found those to be really good and the ideal of that. But spend some time, go shopping, go get a stockpile of shoes, new in the box that fit you well, work well for you, that you like, more underwear, more shirts, more pants, more socks. And for socks, actually, I have found wool socks to be amazing. I don't know why I was so afraid of them when I was younger, but it's like, ah, let me give these a try. So I tried these one called Darn Tough. Yeah, they're comfortable, offer a lot of support and cushion, and they're really tough socks. I figured them a good investment, expensive as heck, so I'm slowly stocking up. But it's a good thing to invest in. I've tried some other wool socks. I found one called a People's Wool or something like that. People's Socks. They're also pretty good. I tried the Kirtland Signature Wool Socks. Eh, not so good. But there's an idea for you. Go buy a bunch of other things, stock up. I would also recommend, you know, having a sewing machine, getting a bunch of patterns, bolts of cloth, uh, sewing needle and thread and stuff. You know, Lee and I are going to do some videos about sewing and making some clothes later. Hope you guys like them. But for you men out there, you're going to have to go embrace the horrors of shopping and getting some more clothes, more shoes, more other stuff to put away. It's important. So suck it up, man up, and get to the store. This is Reed, out for now. Today, we need to have a man chat. So don't go walk, it's clicking off, ah.